long, long list of resolutions. Mm -hmm. And from the article that we read, it well, it turns out to be failure, eighty-eight percent. So, from your perspective, why do people make New Year resolutions when they pro might know that most of them will end up as a failure? Yes. Yeah. As we know that the people around the world will make a resolution because the re the resolution is uh, the common habit for people around the world. Mm -hmm. So everybody just try to make in the uh, new year, and sometimes they, it's so hard for them to uh, do the resolution. Okay. Oh. Okay. Relate. Okay. But um, just to be just to be honest here in Bahrain, um, as I told uh, Shafira, you know, I don't, I am that kind of person who does not write down the resolutions, oh. and I don't have like you know one whole book or like a oh. hundred pages to tell about my resolution. <laughs> so my resolution every year is only one every year. Mm -hmm. So I'm just I keep it to be uh, as simple as possible. So like to this year, 2022, I'm trying to my resolution is like try to relax a little bit, okay, in all terms, okay, just to relax a little bit. Now, um, regarding about the resolution itself, so if I'm not mistaken, okay, correct me if I'm wrong, there's only about 40% of people can maintain their resolution after six months. Now, what are the contributing factors to the failure itself? Is it because of the long list mm -hmm. or what, in your point of view? Yeah, depend on the uh, neuroscience uh, perspective of why people become failure to do the resolution mm -hmm. because the resolution is so hard to do and so many plans that they create and they cannot do the plan consistently. Okay. As we know, our brain doesn't need a, a spectacular plan. Our oh. brain only the, the simple and the easiest plan to do. Mm -hmm. That's the, uh, the answer. Oh, yeah. there you go. Oh, so I am so not basically wrong, we choose the right the things, you know, <laughs> okay. by making the simple resolutions. I know. Right? I'm proud of myself. Yeah. Oh. 2022. I'm. I, I am starting the day with something <laughs> correct. Yeah. Check for me. Oh wow. So, um, according to the psychology, mm -hmm. uh, Afni, is it true that uh, psychologically people need 66 days straight? to change the habit and then it becomes the uh, it becomes a uh, part of our life. Mm, okay. Is that true? Yeah. <laughs> In the neuroscience perspective, we only to do something that we have planned in 21 days only. But oh. we must do every day consistently. Mm -hmm. And when we try to make a new uh, chunk or code in our brain, we mm -hmm. can do at least 90 days consistently. Oh, at least. Oh, wow. And after that, it will become a new habit. <laughs> and something that become a new habit in our brain, it will become as personality, of course. Oh, okay. 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 Now, nice. uh, you did mention that um, actually we did we need to do a uh, consist of 90 yeah. days, right? So actually, sometimes that could be a little bit hard for you know a few people just to you know <laughs> just to be consistent. Now, how can we make it easier for us to pass that 90 days straight? Uh, we have to remember the plan that we make uh, must the easiest and the simple plan okay. and we feel comfortable with the plan yeah. okay. and we must know there are one part of our brain we mm. call it brainstem brainstem always interpret the new habit become as a trait mm -hmm. so we have to remember that so the comfortable plan will make our brainstem comfortable when we try to do the plan okay. so make a simple and comfortable plan that is the simple uh, the simple way or the simple tips for us to make a resolution is there any tips from you um Avni, how we can start uh, the uh, the next 90 days mm -hmm. by uh, you know set up the very simple things right. uh, such as what writing a journal or what set up our alarms oh yeah the that, steps that you something know. like that mm -hmm. 
to set up the alarm is can help us to do the resolution or plan that we have made okay. and uh, we have to remember uh, make a simple plan uh, something related to our daily life mm. don't make or create a spectacular thing for us mm -hmm. so it's hard for mm -hmm. us to to do that uh, in daily life the simple way maybe i will wake up early in the morning mm -hmm. just to do oh, that okay. uh, only one thing only thing in uh, 90 days mm -hmm. uh, do it consistently mm -hmm. and after that when we success to do one plan we can continue to the second plan oh, okay. so uh, only one two or three uh, resolution is more than enough for us in <laughs> one year don't be too ambitious by ah. making like 99 uh, resolutions every day very different true, resolutions Kira. every day very true. no you gonna you will never reach your your the goal you know, goals yes. everything so how um Bafri, how can we synchronize our goals and actions to realize our resolutions. <laughs> we have to remember, we have to set our mindset plan. Mm. Oh. Okay, our mindset is the most important thing. Please set our mindset into grow mindset that we change uh, the way to think about something that our situation, mm -hmm. our condition can be changed. Okay. And after we set a mindset, we try to make one simple plan okay. and do it consistently at least 21 days. And when we try to make a new code in our brain, we can do that 90 days. Okay, so here's a fun question, Mayafni. Okay. So you said one baby step of resolution, okay? Just try to keep it simple, okay? Mm. So for me, I'm trying mm. to relax a little bit more, okay? Now, if if this resolution is going to be done um, correctly for the next 90 days, obviously, yep. um, it's, there's going to be obstacles. And the obstacles, um, mm. one of them comes from the you know inner circle or family itself, right? Now, how are we supposed to make our mindset, um, you know, keep uh, thinking positively when sometimes our surroundings in terms of our own families are not actually like helping the goal. us wow. in the correct way? <laughs> yeah, that's a bit tricky. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. it will be easy for us to uh, make uh, or create the, our mindset if we know the meaning of our resolution mm -hmm. uh, as Rahma said to us that uh, uh, do you want to uh, make more relaxed than before we must know what is the meaning of relax oh. maybe or uh, the way to breathing yeah. or uh, set your uh, time to your have your own time okay or uh, okay just to do everything uh, slowly or okay. there's something like that we oh. have to know the meaning first. oh wow we, we we will not be able our brain will not be able uh, to uh, interpret something if we don't try to uh, learn more about the term that we used in uh, one of resolution that we have made oh okay i get it so we have to be very specific uh in our to set up our resolution yeah. okay. relax is in in general is very in very wide spectrum yes. but you have to choose one easy things that can support the relaxed goals you know that you go to want to be relaxed I will so try. You want to slowing down? You like, you know, something like that. <laughs> oh, okay. okay. So, well, we might facing the obstacles, and there's a lot of challenge with our schedule and everything to stick up with our solutions or our plan. It's quite hard. Yes. Okay. But we can, we can, we can always get back and try to revisit our uh, intention and resolutions again. Okay, that yes. is well said, Shafira. Thank know. you so much, yes, Thank you very much, Mavi, for share your time. Thank a you. simple thing: how to make resolutions be more possible for all of, of us. Of course. Thank, Thank you. you. Have a lovely day. I ah, like. Now we know, right? I know. Now we know.